guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Imogen and for today's video I, I'm joined with my boyfriend Ben and we are back with another haul. Also my brother's dog <laughs> is joining me because he's just decided to come upstairs and tap the door to get in. So we've been to Tesco, B&M, Primark and Smith's. So I'll let Ben talk about what you got from Smith's first. It's a transformer. Yeah, what one what one is it? How much was it? <sighs> Prowl from Animated from like two thousand seven but remade. Uh I don't really know what it is to be honest. Just explain. But yeah, it's that. And it's from Smith's and it was twenty four ninety nine. And yes. Ben's happy with it, so yes. and then we'll move on to the other stuff. So I'll do Tesco next um so from tesco did get quite a bit yeah um, what, what is next to it? <laughs> yours my crippling edge. um yeah so first of all we got some galaxy counters i've got the receipt here you These should take were... them out individually i am right yeah. so galaxy counters these were one pound fifty they're bends but we'll probably share them um then we got some M&M's Krispies, these are my favourite, um, well Ben paid for them, but they're mine, but we'll probably share £1.50. Yeah. And then Ben got not one, not two, <laughs> <coughs> but three cans of the... Yeah, but not just three. Um, yeah, three <laughs> cans of the Rubicon Sparkling Light Chi. Um, these were 55p each, for all three it was £1.65. Nice. So, Ben's got an addiction to like Light Chi at the minute, so he bought three of them. And then, <clears throat> he didn't just buy one, he bought two of the cartons as well. Um, this the cans were sparkling. This is just still light chi, um, the Rubicon one, and these yes. were sixty p each, one pound twenty for both. So that's Ben's. What did you call it? Crippling edition. Addition. Uh, addition. addition. That's it. Addition. Um, and then addition. he also wanted to buy his mum and dad a present. It's nothing like special, but yeah, he just wanted to buy his mum and dad something from Tesco. So he got his dad some shortbread. These were how much were these? Pound. One pound twenty-five. Yeah, but, but club card. Club card was a pound. So he yeah. bought his dad some shortbread because his Thanks. dad likes that. And then we saw this cute um, mug, and we thought it was really cute. And it's just this bee mug, and it's got a picture of a bee, and it says kind and then another picture of a bee and says happy be kind be happy and it's quite like a decent size as well so we bought this for his mum this was two pound fifty and for some reason bees just remind me and ben of his mum yeah. so got that for his mum and then just got the shortbread for his dad <laughs> because your mum would have probably, <laughs> she'd probably just steal some of your dad's shortbread though, wouldn't probably. she? Um, so yeah, that was from Smiths and Tesco. Then moving on to Primark. Ben's been wearing this all day anyway. Yeah, I'm covered um, That's why fluff. he's got like white fluff on him. But he picked up, do you want to talk about it? I don't know if it's a cardigan or not. <clears throat> it's like, it's he, like, yeah, I'd call it a cardigan. Yeah. It's like this... Let me hold on. It's just like this um, cardigan. It's like a white with like blue lining, and yeah. then it's got a B on the side, and it just says Brooklyn. I think it's like a what is it like a I don't know American soccer team or baseball team or something. Oh, is it? Um, I think so. I'm not sure. Oh. But yeah, it's just this white cardigan with like all blue, like, what would, what do you call it? Lining? Outline. Yeah, blue outlining and then a B. And I said to Ben, the B can stand for Ben, but 
It also yeah. says Brooklyn, so this it says is... Brooklyn forever. Oh. This was originally, there was the thing the tags in here. Ben pulled the tag off because he was wearing it today. Um, he got it in a size small because that's what size he is. And it was £16 down to 7 yeah. So he picked that up. I do actually really like it, to be honest. It's not what you said earlier, whilst I was wearing it. Yeah, it just didn't go with the outfit that you had on at the time. But if you pair it with the right thing, it'll probably go right. But it's down to you, innit? Yeah. Um, and then I picked up some more of the... Oh. I picked up some more of these underwear sets because these are... If you have not tried these ribbed underwear sets or any of the ribbed like range from Primark, you generally need to try it because it is... Do you mind? No, I don't mind. Oh my god. I forgot what I was saying. Yeah, if you haven't tried the ribbed underwear sets from Primark, you really, really need to run and go and try these because damn, they, that's a bold statement. No, but they're so run, get they in are so comfortable, I and didn't know. personally for me, I've got like bigger boobs, nice. so they're they're not the best supportive bra, but for like an everyday wear, they're okay. Um, but yeah, I picked up the pink pair. It's like a really like neon pink. You just get the bra and then the thong. I picked up in an extra large. And for the matching set is £6. Yes. And then I also picked it up in this, like, what do you call this, like neon orange? Yeah, yeah, like a neon orange and then the neon pink. Yeah. And then I also have this in blue, um, grey, black, white, nude, lilac and lemon. Do you have that many? Oh, I didn't even know. And then I, there was a green one as well, but they didn't have my size. But I really, really want the green one. It's like a neon green. But twelve pound for two underwear sets. You really can't complain. Six pound each. Um, so that's all we picked up from Primark because all I wanted was some underwear from there. Then moving on to. I don't even remember. B and M. Um, we picked up quite a bit from B and M. To be honest, it is mainly snacks. Don't have a receipt though, so. Um, yeah, we I spent how was... much? About £30 in B&M, mm. um, but we don't have a receipt, so I can't really remember the prices. I thought I had the receipt. <coughs> Do you? Oh, it doesn't matter. Uh, but yeah, they were one first, first thing we picked up, well, it wasn't the first thing, but the first it thing we put out the bag, yeah. um, is these dairy milk, milk chocolate, like Cadbury, little, they look like what they call Rolos. But it's literally just Cadbury's chocolate. Yeah. So how much were they, did you say? £1.29. £1.29. Yeah. And then I picked up a Sparkling Vimto. This was not 65p, this was 55p. I remember looking at the label on the shelf, because B&M always do that. Oh. They do them cheaper, but yeah, that it, was, it was, wasn't that. But yeah, I just wanted to pick up that um not the dog i just wanted to pick up another drink because i wanted a drink wanted to pick up another dog um i actually would buy another dog but I've i want got... another dog my dad won't let me get one because i've already got four but anyway that's not the not what this story not what this story is not about this story not what this video is about then we picked up these where, where did they come from i put them in the trolley i didn't even know um it. yeah then i picked up these frappella uh, they're like the Nutella. Yeah, they like. taste like frappe though. They're a little bit like the Nutella ones. For, um, a pound for two, so me and Ben have one each. <laughs> <laughs> the dog's looking at it because it's food. Um, but yeah, I remember they're a pound. And then we picked up Skips. There's six packs here, so me and Ben can have three packs each. Nice. Um, I can't remember how much these were. One pound um. fifty? Or something like that. I don't know. She'll pick those up. I love how I keep hands and everything to you. I'm just right. putting it everywhere. Anyway. This was where majority of the money went. Mm -hmm. I can't get it out of the bag. Right, this is where majority of the money went, which Ben bought. Uh, you say it like it's bad, but <laughs> I'm not allowed to spend my own money. I can't get it out of the bag. Well, get it out of the bag. Right. Box. Here. Yeah. 
what Ben bought. The box was damaged in the shop. It was the last one there, though. Yeah, it was the last one there. This was £10, which I think's a bit of a rip-off. But mm. I think it is, though, for a bit of plastic. But... Right. Alright, then you can talk about that and then I'll show what else is in the bag. It's a Dalek. A Doctor Who Dalek um, that Ben's been banging on to banging on. Have I? <laughs> about it for ages and ages and ages. Every week we go to B and M. Yeah. We've been to B and M every week for about a month. Yeah. And Ben's been saying, oh, "I really want this. I really want this." So I said to him today, "Just get it. It's the last one there. Just get it." But yes. The box is a bit damaged, but he's not bothered. Sorry. It makes you happy, so... You're scaring the dog. What the hell? What is that? Oh. Why are they... oh, sorry, headphone users. Oh, nice. It's got, like, this plunger thing on. Yeah, they have that anyway. And this, but they, like, bounce. Right, as long as you're happy with it, but £10 for that. I'd rather spend my money on something else. Like that? Um, yeah. Like the rest of what So, then... Oh, there's the receipt. Then Ben picked up these preppy row white cookie Pepper little right. sticky things. Uh, sticky sti things? <laughs> sticks. Um, how much were they? Uh, 69p I think. Yeah, they're like cookie and cream type vibes. Yeah. They're actually really nice. And then the rest of the stuff's mine. Number um, one brand in Korea. <laughs> Damn. Nice. Rest of the stuff's mine. So first of all I just picked up this uh intimate cleansing wash. Uh because that, that's what I use and it's a pound and I've nearly run out of mine so I just picked up another one. I don't know what the hell you've um, got. You pick, put a load of random stuff in the it's trolley. Not it's not random. And then, because I'm doing like a little DIY thing in my room and moving my bags around, I picked up two more of the command hooks because I needed two more. Well, I think I might need actually more than that, but I just picked up two for now. Um, and then I picked up some of the, I can't remember how much these were, £2.49 I think. I can't remember. Um, and then I picked up some of the Command Hook damage free hanging like extra things. Because where I'm taking the ones off my wall I need like the replacement little sticky thing. So I've got some of those um, to stick that up. But you guys will probably see in another video uh, this. So pick those up because I needed them. Yeah. And then last but not least in this haul I picked up some fabulosa um multi surface wipes. Big pack. Yeah, there's eighty wipes in here. But yeah, I, I pick, thought there was more in there. I picked up these. They're bleach free, which I like as well because then it doesn't like damage anything because it's got bleach in and I can use these on my headboard on my bed and it don't damage it um, it says it kills 99% of bacteria and viruses cleans and shines they're multi-surface so you can use them on anything um, and the fabulous ones smell really nice so yeah that's what I've got these were I can't remember the receipts in here oh one pound sixty nine. The a Dalek large, was da large Dalek. The Dalek was twelve pounds. Was it? Yeah. Oh. Not ten. It was twelve. Oh. These were one pound sixty nine. The skips were one pound fifty. The those little like these were a pound. The carrier bag was twenty pence. Yes. The these strips were £2.49, these hooks were £3.79, and yeah. Daleks had £10 of the actual aisle. Well, £12 according to a receipt. Oh. But yeah, that's all we picked up this week. If you enjoy these videos then please give it a big thumbs up. If you want more hauls with Ben, um, I can do more then shopping. 
Yeah, Ben can do more shopping and spend more money on me yes. and himself. <laughs> buy more Daleks. Uh, but yeah, if you enjoyed this video, then please give it a big thumbs up. And I will see you next Friday at 6pm. Thank you for watching. Bye, guys. Say bye. Goodbye. Oh, my God. <laughs>